going on, guys? Back to you with another episode of of and let's get right on into it. So, uh, one thing I do want to say though, uh, with online dating, I was looking at some strange online. I couldn't believe it, but they're saying that almost half of relationships are started online. Like literally almost half. So nowadays, if you see someone with someone, most likely they met online. And I'll even admit it, I met my girl online too. So this is another reason why I'm doing this. I met her online. So obviously there was red flags with her too, but there's red flags with everyone. But the point of the matter is I was able to train her to be the woman I need her to be. Still in that mission, obviously nothing's perfect, but most likely you're going to have to do the same because women don't come ready made in 2023. They don't. Women come as independent women. So you have to train them to be what you need them to be. Just like if they go to a job, they have to be trained to do the job properly. How are they going to come in and be your boyfriend without even knowing what you need them to do or how to be or how to act? They're going to act the same way they acted with their last relationship, right? So you got to kick those bad habits off of them. And if they weren't in a relationship, they're going to have bad single women habits. And those habits have to get kicked to the curb as well. But let's get on with this. Our first lady right here is Signe, and she is 37. And let's see what she's got written. She's in grad school. She's still in grad school, guys. Uh, she's looking for electric chemistry. You're 37, my girl. What is she looking like? Oh, whose boat is this, guys? Filter. Yeah, whose boat is this? That's all I want to know. And who's taking that photo? But you want a man to take you seriously. We got nothing to go on. She's quirky, kind, affectionate, and independent. That's why you're single, because you're independent. We want intra-dependence, not independence. Physical touch, words of affirmation. Yeah, okay. So just tell her what she wants to hear, guys, and then touch her while you're doing it. Hopeful romantic who has zero interest in following you on the IG. That's good. That's good. So she doesn't have an IG, but what else does she have that's keeping her single? You had me with mustache and lost me with the cigar. Okay. Turned on by humor, authenticity, kindness. Okay, none of those... I mean, you wouldn't know if someone's being authentic, honestly, until you found out. Like, so... And how are you current turned on by kindness? Like... I highly doubt if someone being kind turns you on, and probably you probably like it, but it, I I don't I doubt it turns you on. But yeah, she's thirty seven. I would say no to this one, guys. All right, now we got Sarah, who's also thirty seven. Let's see, nothing written about her, guys. Whoops. Oh, I'm looking for my emergency contact. Um, I'm kidding. Sometimes, always. What? I'm just trying to date someone. Anyone. Just someone. Just be anyone, guys. She's in a desperate phase. She's in that phase where she'll take anything she can get. We won't get anything she's given. Alright, so we got Miss Abby, who's 21. Let's see here. Nothing written about her. And she's portly, guys. When a woman is young and portly, it's never a good thing. She's easily going to blow up. You can't be doing this. She destroyed her body. She just doesn't know it yet, guys. She's very portly. She, you throw on some shoulder pads on her, she might do some damage. Oh, yeah. She might do some damage with those shoulders. Now, nah, bro. Don't let her clothesline on you. Yeah, this is a no. All right, we got Rachel, and she's 26. Lover of bees? Uh, no, stop that. No way. And she's a firm believer in keeping fun things in her pocket? Uh, like what? Dildos? Hmm. Dog! Yeah, this would be a no, guys. All right, Lena at 21. Huge knockers. Knock, knock, knock. 
Whoa. Look at, the, like, no waist at all. Like, at all. Huge tits. Oh, yeah. No one's kicking her out. Oh, she's an EMT, though. And then here we go, the sexy photo. So, yeah. Save this for your man. Like, now we all have your body in our minds. Like, that's not great for your husband. Your husband is not appreciating this photo. <laughs> Whoever that sucker might be. We're appreciating it, but your husband is not. <laughs> promise you that oh yeah i mean your husband won't appreciate this but i sure do the men are appreciating it but that one guy yeah that one guy that probably could have walked you down that aisle is running away now i mean it looks good guys like we can't admit like we're all taking that down but are we marrying that the answer to that has to be Like, if you need more than looks, like, this is just 304 activity, man. You're just showing us everything. Like, why do, like, men, like, all us men do not need to be seeing every part about you. Like, this should be saved for that man that you're about to get nasty with. Now we all are, like, there's a man out there jerking off to this photo right now. I promise you. That one, someone's jerking off to this photo. So you just gave them easy access. And they ha don't even know you. Don't even know what your voice sounds like. Like, I, she has no idea what she's done to herself. But this is definitely for fun, though. Like, you can't say no to that. But after that, see you later. Alright, now we got Lexi, and she's 32. And she got chaos on both arms. So let's see here. Chili. Neurodivergent AF. This place is a nightmare. Yeah, so nothing to go on. And she's 32. And I guess she has a Jeep. And she thinks that this tattoo is a flex, guys. See how she has it in the photo showing it off with her face. She thinks, like, us men are like, oh, let's behold to this. That's so cool. That's so cute. My wife. That's what she thinks, guys. Unfortunately, she didn't get the memo. Oh, the butch card. It's the butch card. The butch card. The butch card in a rise. Oh, no, no, no. In full effect. Yeah, that's a no, guys. Dionisiana. At 23. But she's portly. And filtered. Yeah, she is way too portly, guys. Yeah, that's a no. Alright, now we have Everest. And she is 21. I am looking... Wait, let's see what she looks like first. Alright, she's not fat. Uh, I don't know why she keeps cutting off her head, though. Hold on. Wait a minute, guys. Br hold on, guys. She's cutting off her head. So there's a reason for this. In every photo, her head is cut off. Look. One, two, three, four, five... Five photos, her head's cut off. Even this is cut off, her face. So that's six. So six of her nine photos, it looks like, are facial cover shots. Huh. But we see her whole head there, so I don't know. Maybe that was just a malfunction. Because she doesn't look bad at all right there. You just got to hope that she acts right. Most likely, the chances of her acting right are very slim. And where are we here? If she's fit, feminine, friendly, and childless, give her a chance. But if she's masculine, ratchet, or has no class, curses, you know, you know the, the regular nonsense we see from black women. If she has any of that, stay away. But if she if she's in, like those things I said before, say yes. Well, the butch card! It's the butch card! Right out of the gate, it's the butch card! Oh, Oh my gosh. Oh, oh, the butch got on full effect. She got huge tits though. Oh no, I didn't mean to do that. Shit. No, I didn't mean to do that. Bro, I was trying to. Damn it, I don't. No, I didn't want to swipe on that. It's terrible. No, what have I done? Damn, I did not mean to do that, man. 
Now we got Miss K at 35. Jesus, I did not mean to do that. It was the Butch Cut. I would never swipe right on the Butch Cut. Man. Yeah, this is too much face shots. Oh, there it is. Oh, no, no. Mm -mm. There it is. That's a no, sorry. All right, we'll do this and we'll get on to the Bumble side after this. Oh, we got a whole paragraph. But what is up with those eyes, guys? What's going on with that? Why is she looking at us like that? Like, is no one else weirded out by this? Like, I'm, I'm very weirded out. Like, if I go to sleep tonight and I see those eyes and her face looking at me in my nightmares, I'm literally jumping up screaming. What is this? Whoa, yeah, nah, I can't do it. And she's poorly. No, 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 no. And whose jet is that? Like, what? Like, what? No, 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 no. All right, let's get to the bumble side. We can't be doing all that. Carly at 37, though? Dog! And then let's see this. She says, let's see. I love to ski. My family has a place in Vermont. Why are you telling us that? And I have to head up there as much as possible during the winter. Traveler! Also enjoy spending time on the winter or on the water during the warmer months. Love checking out new restaurants, live music, etc. So immature at 37, learn nothing about her except that she travels and likes to go to concerts. And we don't even know what she looks like. So you can't say yes to this. Alright, now we got Elizabeth at 26. Whoops, I almost pressed the wrong one. Marketing manager. Ooh, yeah, I, I stay away from women in leadership positions. I, I, I just, I knew, no, 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 that, I can't do that. But let's see what she's working with. I mean, neither one of these women are fat at all. This one is probably the widest. Her, she just got, you could tell she's got like that, that hip action. But her, I don't know. Let's see, let's hope it's not her. All right, it's not her. So it's this one, I think, the one far right. Weird smile, but average woman. Yeah, she should be married or with someone right now in a relationship working towards that, you know? Like, average women should be with, like, I bet you her mom is with an average man married away. She probably looked like her in her 26 year old age years. I guarantee you they probably looked alike and she was smart enough to get her husband while she was young and have her. Her, she's doing her hot girl summer thing. Thinking that she's hotter than she is. Thinking that she has forever. But, uh, her mom better be telling her what's up. Let's see. I describe myself as a complete catch. <laughs> what? Really? Is that not narcissistic? You describe yourself as a complete catch, but you're single at 26? Past your sexual peak? I don't know how that makes sense. That's very narcissistic to just come out and say that. That's something your match should be telling you. You shouldn't be telling us that you think that you're a complete catch. That That's just absurd. And then she says, I am smart. Come on now. If you were so smart, you would not be writing this stuff right now. Driven? That's not what men care about. We're not like, we're not like, oh my God, I need this woman. She's so driven. She's so smart. We don't, we can, <laughs> We don't want you for those things. And then she says, funny, genuine, honest, loyal, compassionate, and very family oriented. So much so that you don't have your own or aren't even really working towards that. I don't know, man. I am looking for someone to travel with? What the hell? Bruh. Did she not get the memo that men aren't here for your entertainment? We're not here for your travel companions. That's what your girlfriends are for. Like, what the hell? What? Wow, I'm thrown off by that. Go on adventures? So, yeah, so she has no idea. Yeah, she has no idea. She thinks this is all fun and games, boys. Yeah, man, she, she's not serious at all. This is just for fun, guys. Like, let's be honest about this. This is only for fun. Gen Jenny, 31. Huge filter. Completely filtered out. 
kind of sagging collarbones. Yeah, she's not bad looking. She got nice skin. Can't deny that. I can't see the lower half and nothing written about her. So, most likely narcissistic. So, she gets the D and then we gotta leave. So, we got Miss Bailey at 27. She got hips for days, but what the hell is going on with the midsection here? That's kind of weird looking. The midsection to tits ratio looks a little weird. Ah, oh, there it is, guys. There it is. The chaos. The arm chaos. There it is. It's an entire sleeve, too. And where are we? Where are we? Ay, ay, ay. At least she wasn't dumb enough to show us the sleeve side on this because she could have gone on this rail and shown the right arm or left arm depending on which side see she's smart enough to cover it in most photos but how you gonna wear this dress and have your sleeve out like see this is why men don't like women with big ass tattoos like see like you can't even take her to a ball or anywhere nice without this showing like automatically you're just like it's just you're thrown off you're like what is that Imagine you go to a corporate dance and you see everybody with their ladies. They're, they have no tats and you bring your lady in. She's got a whole sleeve on with a dress. Everyone's going to be looking at y'all the whole time. Because y'all y'all would be that sore thumb sticking out. Because your lady is a direct representation of you. So if you're not around and your lady's out in public, she represents you. Remember that. A lot of guys forget that. Yeah, she's for fun, guys. She's sexy and has an arm tat and on hot girl summer trips dressing like a sc hot school girl teacher so yeah she's for fun guys can't take that serious at all nothing written about her narcissistically so that's for fun that's it Demetria at 26 and very portly let's see here uh oh no 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 oh whoa 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 what are you what did we do here? What did we do here? And then this, the cat, cat lady. Yeah, I can't do it. I don't even. I'm not even interested in all that. All right, Miss Magna at 34 has nothing written about her. How can you be narcissistic at 34? And let's see, you're 34 and seemingly portly, and you're writing nothing about you in strange locations giving us three photos like this is nah you can't even be doing all that that is a nightmare if you ever matched with her you're a fool i'll say it. like matching with profiles like the last one we just saw like those are ones that you stay away from like if you match with that you're a complete idiot all right so just teen ooh uh I get a little weary when I see women with close to guy names because sometimes it's trans guys turning into women. So he, this could have been Justin, who now wants to be Justine. So let's let's see here. All right, I think this is a woman here. You can tell this is a woman because no man has no man's arm structure is made like this. Like this is a woman's arm completely. You can tell. Yeah, she got a nice body. Not the best face, but her body's on point, guys. You would definitely need to tell. Oh, this is Boston. I know this is this is downtown Boston. I can tell. I know exactly where that is. This is this is a historical building right there. I know exactly where she is over here. I that's not Boston, guys. I don't know where that is, but this is definitely Boston for sure, hundred percent. That's right by the Orange Line, right downtown this this is what she looks like she's not the prettiest girl but she has a nice body you feel me she's 26 you just gotta tell her to wear some makeup and you're good see look at what she looks like with makeup way, way better way better it's not even close like this is presentable you can deal with that so but easily persuaded by dr pepper or impromptu weekend getaway yeah i'm sure you are so she's immature but she looks good She's 26, so have fun. Aline at 27. We're cusping. Filtered. Nice little derriere. 
All right, we're not models. You know she does not look like that at all, guys. Like, come on now. Come on now. This is what she looks like. Can't see it, though, wearing glasses. I don't know why she chose to put that photo up. She, she's, I think she's Brazilian, guys. Dare I say. Nothing written about her. Hopefully, it's because she doesn't know English. And she's got an Instagram, guys. Ugh. I mean, she looks good, guys. Can't deny that. She's a translator, interpreter. But she has the Instagram. I mean, you can have fun with her, but I just don't know if this will go anywhere. But yeah, definitely have fun. She got that derriere. Zola at 35. Yeah. Uh, right out of the gate. Little portly. And I don't date women that have bigger foreheads than me, so I couldn't do that. Whoa, who's on the other side? Oh, that's a selfie. Never mind. You can tell. Where is that? I don't know. Yeah, nah, this this is not for me. Nothing written about her. Like, you're not that good looking, girl. Davida at 28 and portly. Ah, uh, yeah, we're not even going to do this, guys. This is not anything any of you guys should be getting with. Like, she's 28 and let herself get this big. You're disqualified. Like, unfortunately, you're disqualified. Just like as a man, if you decide to live with your mom all day, all I mean all day, forever and never move out and don't get a job, you're disqualified as a man. So as a woman, if you get overweight, if you act crazy, if you just there's some, there are things that disqualify you as a woman, just like there are things that disqualify you as a man. And being overweight is at, very much at the top of the list. Like, man, like, why should a man accept this? Why should a man build himself up to be the best he can to get this? Like, no. Just like a woman isn't going to keep herself looking her best for a guy that ain't shit. It's the same thing. So this is a no way, Jose. We got Daniela with nothing written about her. And she's 31. And looks good, so that's always a problem. I think she's the one on the right. If that's her mom on the left, oh my god, she's got amazing genes coming her way. If that's her mom. Because this looks like an older woman. But not like too old, but she definitely looks older. I think that's her mom, guys. If that's her mom, whoever scores this woman, you're going to have a pretty young looking woman when she gets older. But the problem is she's immature. So that's the only problem, guys. But she is good looking, so you could have fun. We got Fab, and she's 39. Decent body. Where are we, though? Letting our life pass us by. 39 and on Hot Girl Summer Trips. Now we're on a boat. Whose rail is that? Whose boat is that? Who's taking the photo? Ay, ay, ay. Where are we? Yeah, she's just traveling all over the place, guys. One sentence, guys. Easy going, outgoing, honest, adventurous. Looking for something authentic. She ain't serious, though. She And then she says friendship is what makes a relationship great, guys. Come on, man. What the hell? No, it's not important to be friends with your romantic partner. Because she's an idiot. No, your romantic partners. That's what all. That's where it stays. You're romantic partners. You're not friends in any way. I don't fuck my friends. I, I don't fucking lick my friends. You know what? That, like, that's not my friend. Anyone that you're screwing is not a friend. Like, Jesus Christ. That's a no. I, that's just stupidity. We got... Whoa, let's see what Nicole looks like. With a dog! Whoa, yeah. Nicole's looking a little dude -ish. I couldn't do that, guys. Single mom, 15 year old son, two dogs! Oh, hell no. That's it. That's all I need to hear. Allie at 44. Filtered up. She don't want us to see her wrinkles, girl. Yeah, well, there's older men that want to know what you're looking like. Younger men do, too. For the night, a fun they might have with you. 
because she's clearly a fun girl. Look at how she's... She's 44. She's still trying to dress like she's 21, guys. Look at this. Does this look like a 44-year-old woman? Uh, you take away the filter, and then yeah, but I mean, the way she's dressed? Nah. Hell nah. She's for fun, guys. She's an old hoe. We got Maggie at 39. Filtered up. You don't think Miss Maggie let her life pass her by? She Having fun with all the guys, traveling all over the world. Look at this. Like, she's too old now, clearly. She's using a hella filters right now. Her face is not that smooth. Clearly, her body is in fit shape. And then look at this. Kills it right there. Like, showing us your ass. Like, come on now. Come on, girl. You don't look like that. Why are you freaking showing us a photo like this? This is terrible looking. This doesn't even look good. Your face is not that smooth. You don't look like that. Oh my god, I hate when girls do this. Ugh. No. Like, no, 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 no. This is terrible, guys. Current sitch, or sitch sleeping diagonally across a king size mattress. Um, so she's selfish. She's a deep thinker, loves daily uh, vernacular, includes y'all, ma'am, sir, what the F, thinks like. Proton doesn't come from or doesn't conform to normality, solid emergency contact, looking for someone to mess up lipstick. And I'm like, all right, she's not mature at all, guys. A lot of mumble jumbled stuff thrown together to the point where you're just like, what? So, yeah, she's very immature. Like I said, guys, a lot of women grow old, but they don't grow up. Like this woman is way too immature for 39 years old. She's 39, guys, and look at the shit she's talking about. Like, you, If you didn't see her age or what she looked, well, you, you see what she looks like, fine, but you don't see her age and you read this, you would think she was like 25, guys, or less, even like 19. So uh, she doesn't even get fun, honestly. She's too old to be acting that immature, guys. And then we got Miss Diane with nothing written about her. Three photos, two duplicates. This This can't be happening. We'll do a couple more. We got Tiffany with nothing written about her. And she's 20. Uh, the Butch God! The Butch God! Tried to hide it. This is a no way, Jose. Uh, let's end right here. Miss Liana at 20. But then she has the tat right there, guys. That's not good. That means some strange man had his hand on her tit. A whole handful to hold it in place so he can write that lettering written right there. If you can get by that, then all right, have her. She definitely looks good, guys. Look at she's wearing loose-fitting pants and you can see the definition on her legs. Like that is something special right there. She got a great body. We can't deny that, but is that all she has most likely? Yeah, man, she got a great body, nice skin. Young enough to start a family with, but let's see what she has written. She's a hopeless romantic at heart, looking for someone who shares the same values. Okay, as long as she said values, all right, so that means, all right, that's fine. If you're kind, respectful, and thoughtful, we'll get along great. Look at how much more, guys, compared to that 37-year-old woman we just saw, look at how much more mature that this girl is, who is 17 or 19 years younger. So when that woman was 19... This girl was just being born, and she's still more mature than her. It's crazy. Uh, but she has a Snapchat. But you expect that from a 22-year-old, guys. Uh, that's what you want, some romantic in your life. Ha <laughs> I enjoy deep conversations, trying new things, and binge-watching Netflix on lazy weekends. All right, yeah, I mean, guys, she's way more mature than that other girl. Like... I would say yes to that, guys. And also, we'll end here, guys. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.